Thank you for watching this how-to video. In this video, we are going to be going through the manual rate test that was introduced in 2020.1.3 software for VApply HD systems. To get to this health check, first make sure that you have completed your system setup for the liquid product in question. Here we are using a 3HD 4 row section system. You can see our VApply rate control module plugged in at the PDM, controlling all 12 rows, as well as three VApply HD modules and FlowSense on all 12 rows. If we go back to our diagnose screen, we see that starter is healthy and the rate control module, FlowSense, and VApply HD are all showing up. Within the level three product page, I can now go to the health check option and select my manual test. The manual test allows me to manually set rate and speed as well as control PWM command in order to find the flow limits on this system. As I prepare to test, make sure that your tractor is running and hydraulic and alternators are spinning if needed. Pump calibration has not been done yet, so we will ignore this check here, but make sure that planter switches on the CCM box are turned on. Once we start the test, we will see that we can enter a gallon per acre, as well as control our PWM cycle manually, and adjust speed. So on this system, I want to be able to hit 10 gallons at five miles an hour. 10 gallons per acre, at five miles an hour will result in just about seven tenths of a gallon per minute. Right away, even only at 25%, we are able to hit the total flow rate needed and all of my HDs balance out around 30 to 35 uh, degrees open. So just to get a better idea of what we can do, we will start speeding this system up until the HDs can no longer hit their rate with this duty cycle or PWM command. As we see the HDs open up, we realize that we can no longer achieve the now commanded 1.1 gallons per minute at 25%. And so I will need to start increasing my duty cycle and spin the pump faster. As I keep increasing my pump speed, we start to see the HDs will start closing down and pressure stability should smooth out again. At 85%, we start to realize that we've pretty much maxed out the total rate that this little pump can handle. All three HDs commanding 1.1 gallons per minute gives me a total of 3.3 gallons per minute. And my HDs are almost wide open trying to hit that rate, trying to push enough product through the orifice plates that I have. At this point, I would recommend writing down a max PWM percent of 85% and a max pump GPM of 3.3 to enter into our pump calibration values later. The next thing I wanna do is go ahead and see how slow and what my lowest rate can be achieved until we smooth things out a little bit better. We still have a little bit of pressure instability, but that's likely just because of the high pressure that we are currently pushing through this system. So if I bring down my duty cycle, we should start to alleviate some of that pressure instability. As we slow that duty cycle down to 40%, our stability starts to come up and our HDs are doing a little bit better job of hitting the rates we're looking for. At this point, we can go ahead and select 30% as our new minimum command. We'll write that down and then we'll add up the three HDs again for a total of 0.36 GPM for my minimum rate. I can now go back to my product setup, go into my systems tab, select starter, 
And we will now enter the pump cal minimum of 30%, our maximum at 80%, and then our minimum flow rate, as well as our maximum flow rate. Our pump has now been calibrated, and so if I want to go back and just validate that, we can go back to our health check, go into our starter, select health checks, and this time when we run the test, we will leave duty cycle on automatic, and we'll just command whatever rate we look for, and you'll hear your pump speed up and slow down to hit the rates you're looking for. So now we can validate how well we've done and, and speed up and slow down, increase and decrease our rates and see how well we're able to hit those values all over the board. You've now manually calibrated your system and you're ready for the field.